the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello, Gamer Nom is back. And in this video, I am going to showcase the fully awakened Bumfruit. But first, what are the requirements? First, you need to be in the second C. If you already ate the Bumfruit, you only need one. But for me, I'm using the Quake Fruit, so I ate the Bumfruit. And after that, you just need to talk to the Awakening Master. Okay, so... Aside from this, you will be needing gems. So where can you get gems? You can do raids. Sea Beasts, Oden, Kaido, Big Mom. Boss raids and also the golden arena. Golden arena is where I farm, grind, 520 plus gems. So here you go. If you're able to talk to the awakening master, you gave him, or you have the extra bomb fruit, you will fight an awakened bomb fruit user. So I don't suggest that you use the bomb fruit because it's kind of weak. So make sure to bring a good fighting style or a sword style. Okay, or a sword. Sorry, sorry, sword. Okay. Uh, additional information, this mob has like 1 million HP, so better be ready. There you go, 1 million. Uh, and that's it. It's not easy to defeat as long as you can keep, keep on clicking or pushing your Q button, your dash, and everything will be fine, okay? Gamer Nom, did you use Robux to get gems? No, guys. The Robux, the gems in this game is kind of expensive to be honest. Okay, so now we are going to compare the old skills from the new awakened skills okay okay so here it is you need a total of 525 gems to unlock all the skills so you're able to grind for that now we're gonna compare and decide at the end of this video if is it worth it game or not to awaken this fruit well you're about to find out for the first skill we have the C skill the shot there you go it's a long-range attack not bad. Actually, it's kind of bad. There you go. Slow motion. Let's check the, the range. Oh, that's the range. For the damage, I think we have like 4.12k. Yeah. Now we are going to awaken this. There you go. Talk to the Awakened Master. Guys, you can awaken one skill at a time. So you need 25 gems. Let's buy it and let's equip it. Now let's try it. Z skill boom. Oh, it look, looks better now. See that? Oh, <laughs> it doesn't smoke now. It looks better. The damage is now 7.4k. Almost times 2. Not quite. Almost. So same range. Better visuals. For 25 gems, not bad. Not bad, to be honest. Okay, so for the next skill, we have the X skill, the punch. This is a short range skill. You see that? You need to get closer. There you go. Except the damage is 6,000. Okay, 6.17k. Now let's awaken it for 50 gems. It's getting more expensive. Don't worry. We have enough gems to do it. So, oh, check it out. He's holding a bomb now. Oh no, a cannonball. Okay, let's let's check it out. Cannonball. I'm thinking of Garp right now. Garp, right? Boom. So let's check the damage. I'm quite sure it is higher now. 8.21k, not bad. I like the skill for me, 50 gems. Uh, yeah. I think it's good. So for the next skill, we have the C skill, the triple. Oh, it's a short range skill again. Just more punches. There you go. For the damage, 3, 4.12k, I think. There you go. So 16k. Okay, now let's awaken it. There you go. Oh, not that. I think we need 100 gems for the C skill. There you go. Let's buy it. And let's check it out. Okay, now it's a long range skill. There you go. For the damage, guys, I'm not sure with this, but I think it's the same. But what I'm sure is that it is a long range attack now when it is awakened. There you go. So for our next skill, we have the explosion. There a long range attack too. Okay, I'm quiet. Concerned with the damage. There you go. Let's check the damage, guys, again. 8,000. 8.22k. And to awaken it, you need, I think, 150 gems. Let's check it out. Oh, not that. Yeah. 150 gems. I think this skill will deal the highest damage. Let's check it out. V skill. 
Oh, now it looks better. Wow, there's a lot of damage, guys. But this is a channeling type of skill, meaning you cannot move while using the skill. So there's a high chance that you will get damage. Wow, there's a lot of damage, guys. 4, 8, 12, 16, yeah. Okay. So, guys, last skill. I think this is the most expensive. But, yeah, there you go. 200 gems. Okay, let's buy it now. This is new. This is the fifth skill of the new awakened bomb fruit the bomb bash so let's try it there you go guys two things this won't damage your enemies and from the name itself dash it's not a flight type of skill so it is limited for only five seconds yes you can only use it for five seconds and it will cool down so do you think it is worth it guys so i tried this in the golden arena Straight to the point, guys. Just awaken the quick fruit. Yes. Just awaken the quick fruit. Don't mind this fruit. <laughs> guys, the explosion deals a lot of damage. But again, we need to stop. Don't try doing golden arena or golden raid without a good sword. So I suggest use the acrocyte sword. There you go. Again, guys. Uh, as a whole, this fruit is not good for me, guys. It's just for me. I don't know in your opinion but again guys this is a common fruit this is like the the easiest fruit to get the common but it's a good thing that the developers are improving it right again shout out to the developers maybe this fruit is very good in pvp i really don't know and i don't want to try i want to focus on the quake fruit guys i'm gonna awaken that but i need to grind shards first so again guys, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I appreciate you all. Watch out for that video. And also I am going to uh, make a new level 1 fruit for all revamped fruits. Not to mention the rumble fruit. Yes, for those requests, don't worry. I'm always reading your comments. I'm still trying to complete all the accessories and I'm gonna make a showcase of that. And I'm also going to compare all the swords in this new update, okay? So again guys, that will be it for this video. This is GamerNom, GamerNom out.